everyone and happy Wednesday. Well, today was just a very warm afternoon. 96 degrees was your official high for today. 89 is normal, so we were definitely above average and just shy of that record set in 2020 at 100 degrees. Now, we do expect to see a nice seasonal overnight. That's tonight into tomorrow morning. We're forecasting 63 degrees. Normally, we should be in those low 60s, so this is right about average. 60 degrees in Las Cruces, 62 in Juarez. A massive high pressure system is going to take over the border area and this is what's going to give us the opportunity to see those warm temperatures like we've been seeing calm conditions for the most part. So let's go ahead and break down tomorrow. Tomorrow we're forecasting a high of 96 degrees with westerly winds 15 to 20 miles per hour. So a little breezy hot more than anything. And then in Las Cruces we're forecasting a high of 95 degrees westerly winds 10 to 20 miles per hour. So both Las Cruces and El Paso will see some breezy conditions for the most part. Cold front will slowly begin to push through and this is expected to arrive this weekend. Now before anyone gets too excited, this cold front is really not going to produce a real big, uh, big cool down in our area. If anything, we'll see slightly cooler temperatures than what we've been seeing these last few days, but it's still going to feel awfully hot. Let me show you what I mean. Let's go ahead and look at your nine day forecast. We're expecting to see gusty conditions once again. Again, Thursday, Friday, so that's really not changing too much for us. 93 degrees on Friday, so we do drop just a tad bit. Then on Saturday, we'll see another little drop to 91 degrees. This is when the cold front begins to push through. It's going to push in some of that moisture, and so we're looking at the possibility of a 10% chance of rain on Sunday evening. Looking at 90 degrees, your forecast high, 94 on Monday, and then we'll slowly begin to warm Wednesday into the rest of next week. You're going to notice we do expect to see some windy conditions Wednesday and then we'll continue to see those temperatures in the upper 90s eventually registering what could be our second triple digit high of the year and that would come Friday of next week. Overnight lows will primarily stay in the 60s. Of course if we do get as hot as we're expecting Thursday into Friday we're looking at the possibility of 70 degrees. Now I do want to give a big shout out to one of our weather watchers tonight. This one goes to Tony Leslie from Las Cruces. This is actually from NMSU believe it or not. And we continue to see those hazy conditions out in Las Cruces. This is a beautiful shot of the sunrise over by the Oregon Mountains. And if you'd like to be featured on KTSM 9 News, go ahead and submit those beautiful weather photos to us through our social media platforms or email news at KTSM.com. Monica, thank you. Next, a look at the candidates vying for the County Commissioner Precinct 4 seat as the runoff election gets closer. This is KTSM 9 News at 10.